Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV SHOT Show 2023 here at SIG Range Day with my good friend Phil Strader. You guys have seen this handsome gentleman on the program before. He's going to talk to me about the newest iteration of the SIG P365. We have, of course, the 365 Macro, mm -hmm. which was introduced only a couple of months ago, right? Yes. And before we talk about this one, it's only a slight variation, let's talk about what the original was that, that just came out. So, yeah, the uh, first off, good to see you again. Always good to see you. Yeah. Thanks for the leg touch. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, so that gun, we launched that gun initially. Believe it or not, that gun was supposed to be launched. It's the, it was announced as the X Macro. Uh, but that gun was actually supposed to be launched with a the 15-round magazine that came with the, you, know, you get it as an accessory with the other with the other 365s. And, yeah, we, it's a SIG. It's a SIG. We, 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 you know, we want to do more, right? We want more. Macro means more in this case. So we actually built it as a 17-round gun. Uh, instead of a 15, but we kept the dimensions the same, the overall height the same. So we were able to use some black magic and get uh, 17 rounds for an 18 round capacity carry gun and uh, the macro and Extremely was compact. Yeah, and we also added the uh, the porting, the slide porting uh, compensation to right. the, the original. And yeah, the original version of the macro yes. was a ported version. It was. And essentially we're talking about today, you guys are releasing now a non-ported. That is correct. So it was. It would have been easier just. To, it would have been easier just to put a, an X series slide. Do we do it backwards? I mean, Usually, yeah. It's. It's. Yeah. It, it is. But you know, this was an opportunity. We thought this gun was going to do so well. It made more sense for us to to kind of go to the market with a high end, a high end, you know, boutique ish kind of carry gun. And it turned out that it was a really good move because we have sold so many of them. We're doing very very well with them. But the, 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 the porting wasn't for everyone. Some people just didn't like it. They didn't need it. They felt like they didn't need it. Now, when you shoot it and you realize what it does, sometimes they, they change that tune. But if they don't, we wanted to offer a non-ported version, which is just an XL slide, but we wanted mm -hmm. to take a little bit further than that. Instead of just doing a standard bland gun, we wanted to add some features. So we added a magwell, and of course it's a tack up, so we wanted to add four magazines. That's the rig, big selling point of this gun, but we also, we, we were tinkering with a slide catch lever, and in this case, we actually have an extended slide catch lever. It's not huge, and it won't cause any holster compatibility problems, but it's just big enough to where you can actually manipulate it much easier. A little easier. more of a ledge. Yeah. Yes. I, I mean, I noticed yeah. it was definitely easier to engage. Yes. But, um, but it's, yeah, it's basically it's still, yeah. It's just yeah. a macro. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, and but it's you awesome. say it's just a macro. Yeah, it is. It, it really is. And you say just a macro. Now, um, theoretically, I could take this magazine. Could I put this in a SIG P365, a you, standard 10 yes, round, and absolutely. it would function? Yes. See, that's the amazing thing about the macro, and it's really the uh, the developmental tree of what's come out of what the 365 was introduced in 2017, 2018. 2018. 2018. Yeah. The 365 being basically less than an inch thick, uh, like right. less than four inches tall, mm -hmm. you know, just a, a very compact gun while still giving 11 rounds total capacity right. with flush fitting magazines. And you guys were so successful with that, that now you're offering different permutations. This yes. one essentially being the largest, yes. where you've got like the SIG P365 XL size slide and a larger grip that right. now, I mean, I just can't believe that, that you guys, <laughs> yeah. but 17 rounds, so 18 rounds in a gun that's essentially just as thick as your standard P365 or 365. I'm carrying one right now. I've been carrying one all day and I, I literally forget I have it on. Yeah, so I mean, I, I think, and the reason why I say that is a lot of people are going to be like, ah, you know, like, so what? Yeah. Um, you know, this is just a, a minor tweak of something that, that's already out there. But in a way, every iteration, every evolution of the 365 has been like somewhat of a minor tweak from the original 365. And now you have an entire family right. that offers anything anyone could yeah, want. We wanted a, this is a shooter focused product, right? We wanted as, as many rounds as we could get that was comfortable. So when you look at it, if you think the numbers and you look at the height and all that, it looks it looks similar to other guns that are not in the same class. When you put your hand on that thing, it's when it really, the design really shines. It's another one of those, you gotta shoot it to believe it kind of things. Yeah. And yeah, you know, we couldn't be happier with it. And that's also got a 1913 rail. We changed that for that grip module, uh, obviously for the macro, not for this right. particular model, but that's another standout feature. But you know, this was just an, a, an obvious iteration that we could come out with. We knew we had the, we had the magwell already. So, you know, why not make a tack ops out of it, you know? Um, it doesn't have a threaded barrel, but, you know, 
where, you know. You know, I mean, this is still, I consider this to be like a concealed carry yes. gun. Like, uh, right. you know, throwing yeah. a barrel, I'm not how sure. How tactical you, are you going to get with your yeah, carry gun? Yeah, how tactical are you going to get with, a, with a, a carry gun that. It does have an optic on it, though. Yeah, yeah, which is great. And, yeah. you know, I mean, uh, that's most carry guns mm -hmm. nowadays people, I think, are doing You're right. optics. A lot of people are. But two most important questions for the show. Close this one out. When, how much? Two weeks from now, so oh, February. Right on. Uh, yeah, you're right on that. And 749 or 750 to 800, depending on you know how crazy things get. But you should see them no no more than 750. Phil, Have always a less. treat. A hey, treat. You, know what? you know what? An what absolute a pleasure. treat. I mean, how much better does this get? Pledge all on this side of the table. Uh, all, <laughs> all on this all side over of there. the table. I don't know. All over here. <laughs> Guys, stay tuned. We're going to be bringing more silliness from SIG Range Day and SHOT Show. 2023. Stay tuned. We're never doing this again. <laughs>